Oh, what's going on? We have got our E double T bike all set up lovely jubbly. So far, so good. I've got a massive battery in my backpack though, so we're gonna have to um it's huge, it's not the heaviest thing in the world, I'm not gonna lie. It's a bloody big battery, so we're gonna have to go back to the hostel and drop off the battery and the um and the charger and stuff. So we've got 4.2 miles. 4.2 miles out to the hostel. Fantastic. All right, get to it. Right, first impressions. It's comfy to ride. Um, the bell is very unique. You just twist here basically, which is nice, it's quick. I guess it's designed for London. Problem is the bike's got no gears, but so far so good. I feel like I'm on a, on a bike in Amsterdam. Also, I'm not gonna lie, the pedal assist is a bit like, um, a bit different, a little bit different. So you'll pedal it, it'll assist you, and then it will just assist you for like a couple of seconds after. Which is all right, it's just like, Usually if you want to stop pedaling, it's for a reason because you don't want to carry on going too fast. But it's alright. Then there's a lot more police cars and police vans. One of them being behind me, heads me waiting at a red light. It's a bit long. It's very long. But it's okay, I'm not even on an order, so I'm not even going to stress too much. The police van is still behind me. And that was the guy that was behind me a second ago, he's just sitting near the lights. He's just timed it to absolute perfection. Let's go and take him. Got you, Mr. Soup. Not even pedaling, I'm about to chop you up, mate. I'm about to chop you up, mate. Look at the bloody sunshine. Fucking beautiful! Right, what's going on people? So, just dropped off my battery. Went online, got an order straight away for Temple of Sitan. Temple of Sitan, sounds interesting. Didn't look like it was going too far. So um, it'll be a good judgment to see what multiplier is on. Because it will be base rate, but <laughs> depends which base rate. Uh, the restaurant is 0 0.2 miles away, so really close. So I'll see you at Temple of Sitan. Here we are. I also got a delivery tip as well from some kebab place. I'm not really sure where to go over here, that's good. Yeah, that's it. Thank there you, my friend. Is. Cheers. Now we're going to Capital Kebab. Capital Kebab is four minutes away, half a mile. Let's get to it. Annoyed I'm not in Gloucester because they've just put a 1.4 on for lunchtime. That has never ever happened in Gloucester. That is craziness. So I'm kind of heartbroken I'm not in Gloucester, but we're in London, so let's just do London, yeah? Right, here we are at Couple to Kebab. Hello, gentlemen. Yes, how are you? I'm good, how are you? Good stuff, good stuff. I've got um, 817CO. Yes. You smell? Yeah, yeah. I smell. I smell. You smell? <laughs> All right, first address is 0 0.3 miles away. My phone has already overheated. I've only been out for about 10 minutes. So my brightness has just gone to basically nothing. Which isn't ideal. Well, we've got two orders in our bag. We're about to make some money. We're going down our first tunnel. I don't know if I've gone the right way here. This is very dodgy. I think I'm, yeah, I must have gone the wrong way. Should be above the bridge probably. Getting lost already. <laughs> dropped and I've got three miles to go to this one. So far, I'm not enjoying London, I'm not gonna lie. It's fine now, we'll give it a go. I can't see my phone because it's too hot, but let's go. Right, 
Ooh, 720 for those two, that's not too bad. It did take a little while, but that's not too bad. I've got a double order coming through. So we're gonna go 0 0.6 miles to Wasabi. I can feel the heat as I'm going pretty fast. I'm gonna be so tan by the end of today. Right. We're on Westminster Lodge. 0 0.4 miles away. Oh, these are all closed, man. No, I only imagine to go up five sets of stairs. I'm having to do it twice because I went the wrong way the first time. Went through the wrong entrance, apparently. <laughs> All right, so the guy just delivered to you. He happens to be from Gloucester. He's the first person I've told that I've travelled up from Gloucester. Bloody hell, I'm high up. Look at that. And he's from Gloucester as well. What are his chances in London? Anyway, he's delivered it. We've got another order for Pret A Manga. Hopefully, it becomes a double order. We'll see how much we've got paid in a second. I've got about four miles to back to my bike now. So that paid me £5.35 for those two. Atrocious. Atrocious. I'm sorry to say this. This bike is a great help in it being electric and stuff. But the, the assist doesn't work properly. Like, it will just do it by itself when I'm not pedaling. But then when I'm pedaling, sometimes it won't work. When I'm going uphill, it's a bit of like, come on, electric, be electric. You know what I mean? It's just a bit annoying, but... It's okay, it's not awful. Right, I removed the Pret A Manga because I went to the wrong one, basically. But luckily we've just got a Lebanese Gardens double order, so we're going to pick that up. It's going 0 0.4 miles. I don't know how much we're going to get paid. It's going to be a double order, but the guy said the other one's going to be 20 minutes. So I was like, mm, nah. Yeah, I don't think there's any boost where I am right now, because that paid me £2.62. No, I guess it was reasonably close. But that is atrocious. All right, we've got Sainsbury's. We're picking up a load of beer by the looks of it. Finally, I'm going to deliver to an actual house. £5.47 which is which is not too bad not atrocious somebody give me a £3.98 tip that's nice that's it that order's in nearly a tenner the embankment grocery and we are going 0 0.5 miles not far at all of course it's all the way to the fucking top isn't it <sighs> seven doors I've just left it outside is that okay Sorry, my husband just went downstairs to, to see you, so I was just really Is yeah. there a lift? Yes. There is. Oh, I've walked up. Oh, no, it's I just right behind you. Sorry, and probably my husband was just in the, in the lift. And so, we... so that's why it was... Okay. <laughs> no, it's fine. I'll Thank probably see him on the way down. Okay, thank you. Bye. Ooh, we're pretty active down here. We've got preachers, musicians, electric bikes. Right, we're at Subway anyway, to pick up the first of our double order.
online on Uber. We're online on delivery. You're just leaving me at a hostel. Let's get some orders. It's six minutes past six. So much money we can make. We've got a full tank of fuel. So um, let's get to it. Right, what's going on? We just got a double order straight away from a restaurant we're very close to. £7.22. I might just do the one. I'm not too sure. We'll see when we get there. Right, one of them was ready and one of them was going to take five minutes. So I'm just taking the one. It goes from £7.22 to £4.6. <laughs> you with that? We said that for wait another five minutes. Smells unbelievable. <laughs> See you later, man. Alright, we've got a mole can go into somewhere for £3.20. Let's look offline on Uber for the hot minutes. I'm going to do this mole leaves, just around the corner. Yeah. They just put a postcode, that's it. That's it. And they're technically like, I haven't heard the bell ring, but this this place, I've looked you beside the building, but you haven't rang my bell on that because you haven't given me the address. You've only just texted me the address. So wonky. Now I've got to try and find the Osprey building. Which I think I saw was down here when I was riding for it. Hello, hello, hello. Hi. Sorry, it didn't no, show me an address. It's very strange. It's so weird. I'm sorry, because I didn't actually, I was on the phone and I was like, someone is insisting on calling me, so I should yeah. probably... Was well, you getting the text I was sending? No, I got your text though. Yeah, I didn't okay. get text, so yeah. I was responding to the text. You, no, I was responding to the... No, I texted you first, I didn't get your other text. Oh, right, that's really confusing, because I was texting you on the Uber app. Oh, I didn't get your Uber app text, I'm no. sorry. Oh, no, that's fine. Life easier for you. Yeah. Sorry. It's fine. No, no, don't worry. We, we, we got there in the end. Mm. I think when I marked it's delivered, there was three seconds left before I was supposed oh, to leave it somewhere. I, so you, you got there just in time. Perfect. Thank it's you fine. so much. Thank you. No worries. Have, Have a good day. one. Thank you. Rejection rate is falling over. Um, I pretty much accepted every order earlier, but now they're just giving me the whole, the whole camera. Right, well, I've accepted an order for Viet Quang. We're at Viet Quang. We've arrived. It's going to Old Canary Wolf. And we've just got an Uber come through as well, which is not going towards Canary Wolf. So I'm going to bid it off and do the delivery instead. Yeah. It's a nice bike as well. Yeah, I know, yeah, that's the thing. That's right. I think we just have to build this one. I love to build this one. Yeah. Yeah, no, it's a good idea. I like it. Yeah. Man, I actually love it when like, a restaurant says two minutes and then they're two minutes. It's like the best feeling ever. And that makes everything so rewarding. Hey, I'm trying to take this order now. What a lovely little route this is. Delivery? Yeah. You? What's your name? Yeah. Okay, no worries. 
Yeah. First person I see. Hello, you have a lovely smile. Oh, thank there you. you go. Thank you so much. No worries, have a good one. She was so cute. Oh, we've got an order. Come through for £7.24. Apparently I'm already here as well. Makes it even better. It's called the Canada Ya Ramen Bar Greenwich. Pretty sure I've um, pronounced Greenwich wrong. Pretty sure it's Greenwich, isn't it? That's really good. The destination is three miles away. Let's get to it. Another nice little park. Loads of people out. Enjoying the evening sunshine. Barbecue going on over there. How oh, lovely. How lovely. That feels a little bit risky going to KFC. I feel like it might be busy. I'm definitely not going to any McDonald's past 12 o'clock going on London Eats advice. KFC, they're pretty quick usually. Even when they're busy, they're still pretty quick. So we'll see whether Peckham KFC deliver the goods. I think it's over here somewhere. There it is. I'm getting used to using this now. I'm getting the gist of it. It's getting quicker and quicker every time. Let's go. Okay, uh, what's just that one there, please, mate? Thank you, mate. Just turned up. I was literally looking for number 20 and they've just rocked up in the car. She's just turned up in the car. Ah. <laughs> I guess I don't need to push the door really hard now, do I? <laughs> That's good timing, you did well there. Yeah, my cousin was doing Thank you so No much. worries, it's so. Oh, I've got another order. Can I, can I order from Deliveroo, but it says just eat. Yeah, I know. That's because if... <laughs> you have to, innit? <laughs> Safe, man. <laughs> Alright, see you later, guys. Enjoy the food. Beamer is beautiful. Jesus, it's got that purpley blue little finish. Anyway, we're 500 meters away from the next restaurant. Let's get to it. So, we're doing the Peckham ship tonight, lads. London Eats has just given me a bell because apparently he's in Peckham as well. I texted him saying I was in Peckham. So I think he's going to tell me which restaurant he's going to. And um, I'm going to meet up with London Eats. This is literally only going around the corner. Three pounds thirteen, which is better than what it would be in my city. It would be two pound ninety every day of the week. Every day of the week. So let's get to it. Huh? This 
this is active, like active via yoga. All these girls are looking at me that they want some of my delivery. Well, have I got delivery? I've got delivery, ladies. You best believe it. Just got an order on delivery for Lolak Afrique restaurant. This is on par of riding through Bangkok. This is what it feels like. It's pretty bonkers. I love this street, man. This street's fantastic. It's like Barton Street times a million. <laughs> This bike just accelerates without me even wanting it to. I quite like it to be fair because obviously it's effortless. But it'd be good if I had control over it. Crazy markets completely. Okay. Alright, let's go for our next one. Right, we've got another order to come through. And the thing is, when they come through, they're always so flipping close. They're always like just around the corner, like every time. And they're going like two miles, two and a half miles for like a fiver every time. I prefer that than having to travel to the restaurant every time. All right. Where is it? Bone Daddy's Ramen. Ah. In here, maybe. Bone Daddy's Ramen Bars. Here you go, okay. Perfect. Thank you, mate. Who am I? Yeah, that's right. I'm London Eats, bro. I'm London Eats part two. I've got some nice music in my ears, some hot, upbeat music. Right, my bike, I've figured it out. I understand how it works now. So yeah, I'm feeling nice. My, my back does hurt, but I'm, I'm enjoying myself. I, I could stay out to 3 o'clock in the morning if I wanted to. No worries, have a lovely evening. My back's gone, my back's just not good. No order straight away on delivery, so we're gonna we're gonna go online on Uber. Uber treated me well earlier, to be fair. A couple of people giving me tips, some half decent prices and stuff. So obviously, I don't know what multiplier it is because I don't know if you've been watching Gig Hustle, but he went to Birmingham, I think. And uh, oh, we got an order. Do I want to do that? Do I want to do that? Why wouldn't I do that? Another £4.35 in a back pocket. Um, yeah, so apparently it takes a couple of days before the multiplier shows on the screen, which makes no sense. There's, there's lots of things with Uber that make no sense at the moment because when you do Uber Eats in America, it just makes sense. But in the UK, it doesn't. Anyway, oh, that feels that strap I've just done there has just taken all the weight off my back. I don't know why I don't do it like this all the time. And this is the reason why I haven't been on Uber because I get depressed with the amount of McDonald's as they send me and I just go offline and I'm like, I'm not, I've had enough. I've just had 15 McDonald's come through. I'm not having any more. Right, let's go pick up this delivery. Right, so I found 26 and 36. I'm looking for 22. So it's probably these ones here. But I'm trying to call her and she's not answering. It says the buzzer doesn't work. The buzzer doesn't work because she's not answering her phone. So it's like, what can I do here? Break in. I don't know why, with Uber and with Deliveroo, sometimes my texts and calls don't go through to the customer. Even though it tells me that it does. Right, the wagons is ready. 
There's a few guys laying outside, I walk in, just grab mine. I feel like Deliveroo. I feel like that time in. Huh? I was speaking to my camera, bro. <laughs> That's jokes. I feel like my time in with Deliveroo, like how fast they am to restaurants in Gloucester, they've kept that for when I'm in London. So they know when they send me an order and they expect me in two to three minutes. I'm going to be there in two to three minutes. It doesn't matter what city I'm in. So I think that's why everything's been on time tonight. Pretty much everything's been on time. A couple of the orders I've just gone and gone, wow, there's like six, six riders, that's what happened here. Um, yeah, it's been pretty well. It's been pretty good timing so far tonight. I've literally, this woman's been trying to find this court for me for the last five minutes. She's just been walking me around. Oh, it's done that. Oh, that big three right at the front, isn't it? Yeah, I thought, yeah. Okay, all right then. Did I hear mansions? Yeah. So it's inside where it's See, look, this should have been a tip as well if I wasn't like 30 minutes late. <laughs> Come on, I'll jog with you. I ain't got nothing better to do in anyway. Yeah, where was you off to? Uh huh. Is that? You look like a natural athlete. Do I? I don't exercise. Do you not? Nope. How old are you? 37. Fuck off. You're pulling my leg. Huh? You're not 37. Um, You're 17. Yeah. <laughs> You're not 37. You'll leave it. And my son is 11. That's mental. Yeah. So you're telling me it's all the way over here? This is crackers. Waggers. Yes. I've had a neighbour that she brought me. You know what it is? When they give the people the, the directions, it doesn't say exactly where it is on the map. Because they brought it right down to where the pub is. I think, I think yeah. it gives like the back of the building, which is like an entrance yeah. to the back of the building yeah. or something. Yeah. No worries, man. You're welcome, yeah? Anything? Thanks very much. Yeah. If I could have you for every delivery, I would like. It would be helpful. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Do you want this actually? Thank you, mate. Cheers, guys. Cheers. Yeah. What's this I got lost yeah. um, on the last order and he wasn't answering their phone. Yeah, that's alright. Yeah. Because you helped me out. So. Oh, thank you. It's like some beef something with rice. I don't know. It's probably. I'll try it on. Yeah, why not? Yeah. But yeah, you probably should take my number. I don't know. Come then, if, I'll tell your number. If you're around, you just said, Toy, do you know where this is? What what ends even are these? Like this is genuinely my first time in London. This is today. this is Campbell. South Southeast. Southeast. Oh seven. Look, I've got this thing in my hand, so this is why I'm getting it wrong. Nine eight nine eight seven five two three. New contact Toya. So where are you from then? I'm from Gloucester. Gloucester. Do you know Gloucester? <laughs> yeah, I know about Gloucester, but I don't know it like that. Yeah. Do you get me? Alright, I'm gonna drop you a text. Yeah, man. Anytime you're around or whatever, and if I can help out, I don't mind. I'll probably see you anyway. Yeah. <laughs> see you later. Alright, see you later. Enjoy your Bye. food. She was lovely. Uh, not back to Wagamama's. Um, yeah, I, I really wanted to eat that to be fair, but I'll give it to her anyway. I'm gonna reject that order because I feel like it's probably been waiting for me for ages. Right, I'm gonna head back, I think. That's actually so big. I just watched an ambulance wait in traffic because it just couldn't get around, so I just had to sit there till the lights went green. That was so peak. Anyway, I've got a double pizza hut come through. Fuck it, why not? Hopefully it's not going absolutely miles away. Hopefully it's going towards where I want to be going, but obviously I don't know where it's going, so... Uh, it's not down here. That's me. Yeah. 
to be fair, I could do with ETT giving me some bike lights tomorrow. Um, but there is one on the back, it's not very good, and there just isn't one on the front. So it's like, it's not great. Nailed it. I got these two. I'll see you. The brown derby's pretty active. Fucking hell. <laughs> Where did COVID go? Where did it go? It is going. Surely. <laughs>